Okay, here's the card for this week. It's a really simple but pretty card. Um, pieces you're going to need. You're going to need um, five, four and a quarter by eleven sheet of white, and a piece of three and three quarters by five. So the first thing you're going to take is you're going to take the third layer, and you're going to stamp this background right here. Sorry, basic gray. And my large stamps I always ink upside down. I'm just going to set it across the card front. And this is um, stamp sets called Everything Eleanor. See how nice that is? And then I got to get my words in there, and I'm going to do Thinking of You. And I'm going to put that right across the bottom. Alright, so what I can do now is I can do, do up my layers. I can um, fold my card face in half and then glue layer down then my next my gray and when you work with our white cardstock in gray and black try not to touch the stamped image because it's slow to dry particularly on the white cardstock and then it all goes together on here Okay, so now the fun starts. I'm going to take pink pirouette and I'm going to stamp it on a piece of scrap paper. And when using these little um, petite petal and the punch that goes with it, try to make the two petals dance across the bottom of your scrap. Meaning put two petals down. It'll be a whole lot easier to punch. This is what it, see so so now when I go to punch lining it up because the two petals on the punch are down at the bottom makes it a whole lot easier okay got those done the next thing is to take some pink scrap and I'm gonna punch out these little pink flowers and one gray one two three four I need four And then I need a gray. And then the last thing is to do my butterfly. And my butterfly is also in gray. Great set to have. has six different butterflies. I just love the image it makes. And we also have a punch for the butterfly. See how quick this is going. pretty quick. Okay, so let me get my card back out here. Oh, and let me show you a trick. Grab anything that's a soft pad and in order to get these flowers to pop up, you just kind of take something. Now this has a rubber tip. This is a the distressing tool, but you could use a stylus. You could use anything that kind of has a rounded end. So I'm just rubbing it on the inside and look how cute it just makes those flowers pop up. See how cute that is? And I'm going to do it on all of them. Okay. It's a fun little technique. So now let's get them glued down. And then these little guys go on the inside. I'm going to put the gray one right here. Okay. 
Okay, so then the last part is to put in the pearls. I use two sizes of pearls for a little itty, and of course, you know me, I use my scissors. So when I reach down and grab the, try to get up underneath and get that glue dot. And then on the bigger ones, use a bigger pearl. And then the last thing is to do the butterfly. I'm going to use a glue dot on my butterfly. I may just put him there in that blank spot. So there you have it. Another great card. Alright, till next time.